This animation will show how a coronary artery bypass graft, or CABG, is used to treat coronary heart disease. Click the navigation arrows below the animation screen to play, pause, rewind or fast forward the animation. The network of blood vessels that branch over the surface of the heart are called the coronary arteries. Coronary heart disease occurs when fatty deposits build up and form a plaque or atheroma on the artery wall. This causes the artery to narrow and harden, reducing blood flow to the heart. A CABG can bypass the blocked arteries so that blood can flow more easily. A coronary bypass graft, or CABG, is carried out under general anaesthetic, which means that you'll be asleep during the procedure and feel no pain. If blood vessels from your leg or arm are being used for grafts, your surgeon will remove and prepare these first. A blood vessel, such as a superficial vein in the leg, which lies just below the surface of the skin, can be removed to use as a graft. A cut is then made down the middle of the breastbone or sternum and the rib cage is opened so the surgeon can reach the heart. The surgeon may attach the new grafts while the heart is still beating, but it's more common for medication to be used to temporarily stop the heart. The blood is then rerouted to a heart-lung bypass machine. This takes over from the heart and lungs, it adds oxygen to the blood and maintains circulation. The graft is attached from your aorta, your main artery, to a point in the coronary artery beyond the blockage. Sometimes a graft is also created from the internal mammary artery, which is diverted from behind the sternum or chest bone. After the graft is attached, the heart is restarted with controlled electrical shocks and the sternum is rejoined using wires. The skin on the chest is closed with dissolvable stitches. This is the end of the animation. Click on the animation screen to watch it again.